All right, guys, we about to change this uh, rear door actuator. I'm gonna show you what it's doing right now. It's the new part. Um, we cannot get in here. It's unlocked. You just hear it clicking. And eventually it comes open. This panel comes out in two sections, guys, but we're gonna try to just remove this down some and uh, leave these out. Torx T35 or T30. We got one right here. We're gonna unplug this switch. One right here. Pop this panel off. And there's three bolts holding this. We're gonna get this out of here. Move, do this real quick, guys. We're gonna do this super quick. All right, let's get up and close. These are T30, guys. This is the one. On the door here, back of the door. Put you guys up and close on everything. Set that right there. That's up for the handle. Same size. This should pull off. Holds on by some clips. So it'll ultimately come out like like this. We don't gotta remove this, guys. This is attached to the trim. Well, we didn't have to remove this one either, guys. All this comes off. We could have left that in place. We have to take that off. Okay guys, somebody's been in here already. Look at all these marks. Somebody's been messing with this. And they didn't know how to get it off. I don't know, this is not a new part. Look at the, this is halfway out. This is halfway out. This is all scraped up. So, it don't look like it's been replaced. It looks like somebody tried to fix it somehow. And I wanna show you guys, with these clips, they're on the back side. So, you, so the goal is to get in here and pull out to pop these away. Go in here and pop these away. Look at those other clips. So this is all we need. We don't need much room, guys. We don't have to take this whole panel off. So let's uh, remove these. These are also Torx T30. And then we're gonna unplug it. guys once you get it out just press down on the back of this so press down on that it comes right out plug holds on to this tab press down and it pulls out so this is the new one the old one Listen to this, guys. Listen to this. Nothing. Old one. New one. All right, they're identical, pretty much. This is the factory one. 
Yeah, that's the market one. Pretty much the same. So let's install it, guys. A couple minutes. All right, guys, we installed this in less than some minutes. So, uh, let's see. I don't know if this is gonna work. I think I gotta set on manual. So let's set it on, let's take it off manual, guys. Let's make it function back again. This is the manual feature. That's, oh, it's closing. Perfect. So let's check it, guys. Perfect. All right, guys, you found this video helpful, guys. Subscribe to the channel. The next thing we're gonna do, guys, is uh, the motor, the oil pan gasket came for this car. GM OEM oil pan has an oil leak, and um, we're gonna. Motor mount, the driver's side motor mount needs to be replaced. So subscribe to the channel, guys. More awesome videos coming. Uh, very detailed. Terrence and I'm out. Oh, right, guys, I forgot. Let's check the remote. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. So, guys, I got, also got a windshield. Uh, I just replaced the sensor. As well, guys, for the for the rear window, you can watch that video. Check out on the channel.